Hey guys, this is Mark with YouTube. I'd just like to make a tutorial today on the new Samsung Reclaim phone on how to set and make your own MP3 ringtones for this Samsung M560 Reclaim. Um, and the way to do this is with a uh, cool software. It's called Super. And I'd like to thank uh, my girlfriend for showing me the software and sending it to me. I um, put it through rapid share and I made a link in the description where you can download this software and um, if you have a data cable this will work along with the software the um, software again is called super what you want to do is download it and do the install which is right here it's called super install um, and then you want to go ahead and load the software when you load the software you're going to see the eWrite soft uh, company name which is for the software called Super. And when the software loads, it's actually going to look like this. It's going to be set uh, on the 3G mobile, uh, or 3G Nokia. What you want to do is you want to click on this first option right here, which is the output. And you want to choose 3G, 3G2, Motorola, Sony. And when you choose that, you want to make sure that you remove the uh, video you want to disable the video so right here on the video area click that where you're going to disable it the next thing you want to do is um, drag and drop the mp3 file that you would like to make as a ringtone so what you want to do is get your song that you would like so we'll pick out a song from here Let's just say we'll do uh, Beach Boys, California Girls. So we're going to drag that down into the dr drop area, which is the drop a valid multimedia file here and this location. Now, what you want to do is you want to make sure that you know where you put this. And the way to do this is you're going to go in and right click on it, the file itself. Go ahead and go to the output file saving management which is the little red disk drive click on it and as you see there's the browse the, uh, file folders location where you want to place it the way to do this is you uncheck the first box and in my case I'll have the file go to the music uh, drive or a folder so you can put it in your specific drive and then whatever folder you'd like it to go to so this way you know where the file goes then you click on the save again and then save changes once that's done you go ahead and click encode to encode this uh, song what you want to do before you do that is click on the 3G2 because this is going to be the format that you're going to use for the Samsung M560 you can click the 3G2 click OK once it starts um, going through the process of encoding the song, it's going to take a little while. Um, you can do large songs, which is not um, recommended, because if you do large songs, it does take a while for your phone to load the songs, and depending on your size capacity of your memory card, your memory card, it's not uh, worth doing because it does slow down your phone as you're loading it. Once it's done, uh, what you did here, the tone, once it is finished, you go ahead and close out of the software. And um, I'm going to go ahead and pause the video. I'm going to also show you real quickly. Um, right here, it did save the file. So I'm going to pause the video, hook up my phone, and I'm going to drag that if, uh, file, and I'm going to show you where you need to place that file into the phone. So I'll be right back after I hook up the phone and please wait. Okay, now that I have uh, hooked up the phone, you see the folder that it comes up with now. Um, again, you see on the right hand side where the uh, Beach Boys file has been saved. It looks like this. Now on uh, maybe Vista it might look a little different uh, once it does save, but you, as long as you know where the file or folder that you placed it in on that f file, you should be able to locate it. Um, Again, this looks like that because it's in Windows XP. Now, the f folder where the phone is, which uh, for mine is the H drive, you want to click on the DCI, DCIM folder and then the 100 SSMED folder. And as you see, there is uh, one file already in there, encoded file that I placed in there already. 
So I'm going to take this new one that I created, drag it and drop it into that folder, and you're done. Now I'm going to disconnect the phone from the computer, and I'm going to show you exactly how to set it in the phone itself. Okay, I'm going to actually show you uh, with my phone. I'm sorry it may not be that very good to see, but if you click, uh, go to the menu, menu, go to settings, and then you want to go to sounds, and once you go into sounds, you go to ringer type, and then when you go to ringer type, you go to incoming calls, and then you want to click OK again at contact entries, all contacts again, click OK. Go to my uh, my videos, go all down to my videos, and then go in memory card. Now, as you see, I have two of them already in there, and what I'm going to do is the first one is the one that normally is going to be the one that you just downloaded, so we're going to go ahead and check that out, click play. And there you go, that's the um, Beach Boys uh, California Girl song. So you want to go ahead and assign it, which is, I'm not sure if you can see that, it's the one on the left. So assign it. And there you go, it's been assigned. Now you can also do this uh, to your contacts. If we can open up the phone here. We can go to contacts and then choose a name the person go to the default ringer go to change go to my videos in memory card and there you go and all you gotta do is just click assign and it'll assign it to that uh, specific person that you'd like it to be their ringtone Again, this is Mark. I'd like to, uh, again, thank my girlfriend, Andres Vox. She's on YouTube for showing me the software for the um, Reclaim 5 M560. Any other questions or concerns you may have, please give me an email at the YouTube channel, and I'll be glad to assist you in any way possible. Again, this is Mark. Please rate, subscribe, and comment to my videos, and have a great day.